Hey guys, on this episode of Unusual Foods, we'll be doing a taste test of this thing, the bitter melon. The bitter melon has this name for a reason, because it's apparently bitter. As you can see here, I have two bitter melon. This one, which I've chopped up and cooked. This has been steamed for a couple minutes. And uh, this one is fresh. So I can cut into this and show you what it looks like before and after cooking it. And um, yeah, so this thing originates from Southeast Asia. Um, this one here is a Chinese bitter melon. There's also an Indian bitter melon, which I'd also like to try, which looks really gnarly. It's got really dark green bumpy um, bits and stuff. But uh, yeah, this is the Chinese version. It grows in subtropical and tropical regions. And it's a, uh, it's a gourd. It smells like nothing. It's just kind of bumpy and that's about it. So let's cut into uh, this guy so you can see what's in here. So open it up. So this one, um, I'm not quite sure. Once I do a video on this on uh, my main channel, then uh, you'll you'll find out there. But you can see this one has pinkish pod holder uh, things for the seeds, and this one is yellowish, and this one the seeds are black. Pull a couple. Of, ew, that's hot. That's a hot potato. Ooh. Pull these out. So the seeds are black. These look like they're fully developed seeds, where these do not. So I'm guessing this one was just more ripe. I don't know if that affects the flavor or not. So I don't know, something to think about. Doesn't smell like anything. The inside is very spongy. It's come out kind of like a loofah sponge. It's uh, uh, yeah. It's kind of got like a, it separates. You can see there's a ridge here and it's as I peel or pull it, it kind of separates off of the, the outer green flesh. So let's try this thing out. We'll see how bitter it is. So I'm going to start with just the ridge. I'm going to separate from the inner stuff and then we can take a bite from the inside and see if it uh, makes a difference. So the cooked one, it's kind of smells like a like a mix like a mix of broccoli and and Brussels sprouts. Oh yeah. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> That's gross. That is gross. <laughs> is this <laughs> Is this really edible? Ugh. Woo, yeah, that's, so this, um, the bitter melon tastes delicious. Uh, <laughs> oh, the initial taste tastes like, uh, it tastes like fermenting wine. And bitter, bitter fermenting wine. Oh. What's that other flavor? Like Clorox or something. Like it's, ew, 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 <coughs> ew. It's so gross. So apparently, this is put into soups of your uh, arch enemies and uh, <laughs> as stews and stuff. It's like Chinese dim sum. They put this in there. Oh, if a if a if a Chinese chef can make this taste good, then they're uh, considered a master chef. Because this is just absolutely putrid. The seed pods are really cool, though. I'm gonna try eating one of the seed pods without the seed, because I know the seed will not taste good. I'm not going to save these seeds because I don't ever want to eat this again. <laughs> But seed pod. Wow. The seed pod tastes good. It's got a nice like spongy texture to it. I still have this taste in my mouth. Oh, I have some lemon water here. Okay, let's try this again. Okay, so I've got three seed pods. Oh, that tastes nice. Yeah, it tastes like um, 
like a really lively uh, green bean. Hmm. Very interesting. So apparently the outer flesh is to deter uh, creatures from eating this thing. Well, that one has a seed in it. Hmm. Yeah, don't eat the seeds. It's like biting into like bark. Yeah, there's a really nice spongy quality to these seed pods. They have a really nice rich flavor. I don't know if I want to go through all the work of preparing this just for the seed pods, but they do taste good. I will eat the seed pods. The rest of this bitter melon, I don't know what to do with. Okay, one more for YouTube. I'm gonna take, I'm gonna just eat this whole big piece because, you know, YOLO. Oh no, oh no. <laughs> <laughs> Why me? <laughs> it's so gross. Mm. <laughs> it's so disgusting. It's like... I'm like trying to hold this down here. It's so gross. I don't know, maybe some apple cider vinegar, some sort of sauce like that, just to cut through that bitterness. I wanna get all the seed pods out of here just cause they taste so good. Here, I'll actually show you. So here's, this is all the seed pods. So there's actually a decent amount of material in there that's that tastes good. You have to remove the seeds, which is a pain. I should've, I should've, didn't, uh, I should've done that before I cooked it. If you know a good recipe, be sure to leave it in the comments below. Hopefully you enjoyed uh, seeing me suffer eat, eating this uh, bitter melon. Be sure to, why don't you check out another video here or subscribe and until the next one, have a great day.